Coming to the Temple Theater this weekend, the latest terrifying documentary from Saginaw's own paranormal investigators. Ooh, spooky. A haunting on Finn Road, The Devil's Grove, premiering Friday night. TV 5's Ashlyn Hill scaring up the director of Haunted Saginaw for the spooky genre's origins. As a police officer, you work with the facts. Kyle Glockstein sees most things in life as black and white. Either it is or it isn't. So when the Hampton Township police officer got the call to help in a search at a potentially haunted house, he wasn't quite sure what to expect. We assisted uh, Steve and his crew uh, searching the house uh, for anything out of the ordinary. And out of the ordinary is exactly what they found. And it was all captured on film as part of the Haunted Saginaw series. For the past nine years, paranormal investigators have set up shop in homes and businesses across mid-Michigan waiting for a chance to catch ghostly activity. We get strange calls, but this is a whole different animal. We were there for six months, which is unprecedented for any paranormal investigation. A lot happened in those six months, you know, uh, ranging from mysterious fires. Several freak accidents occurred while we were there, to say the least, that involved, you know, emergency services. Stephen Shippey is the director of each film. A Haunting on Finn Road, The Devil's Grove is his ninth installment. He tells me he makes it a point to investigate local hotspots. You know, our Tri-City history is very important. Uh, people, I believe, come for not only activity that we catch, but also the history, and it's obviously a community thing. So every year the film premieres right here at a darkened Temple Theater, adding to the ambiance. Haunted Saginaw on the Temple Theater, it's at this point, you know, it's definitely synonymous. It's a, you know, beautiful old place. Um, the fact that we fill it up, see per see, it's amazing. I mean, it truly comes alive. In Saginaw, Ashlyn Hill, WNEM, TV5. Attendees will also get a DVD copy after the show. Tickets available at templetheater.com or at the theater box office. The premiere is Friday and Saturday.